Good evening. This award is not simply an honor and recognition of my work. It is an honor and recognition for the hundreds of human rights and environmental activists across Africa. On their behalf, and on my own behalf, I wish to thank the Goldman Environmental Foundation for this extraordinary act of solidarity and honor. The IMF and the World Bank have been writing the rules of engagement for the countries of Africa. The result has been mass poverty, homeless children who ought to be in school, squalor, war, disease, and the death of our forests and rivers. This is exacerbated by the greed of those with power and influence. We cannot run away from the fact that the poverty, thirst, and hunger of one continent are a threat to the security of the rest of the world. In this situation, the most noble of causes left to us as civilized people living on an endangered planet is to fight for clean water and a safe environment for all. This, for me, is the greatest calling of the 21st century. I would like to make an urgent appeal to all of you to rise and change the paradigm that compels poor countries to sell their water to the highest bidder for profit in the name of free trade. Indeed, what ought to be free is water and not trade. This award will provide fresh impetus for my work and new resources to strengthen our community networks in defense of the right to water in a safe environment. As you go to bed tonight, remember, as you flush your toilets, or as you decide whether you want to have a cold bath or a hot bath, that millions of kids in Africa and elsewhere are desperately in need of just a liter of water to survive their day. I hope this thought will convince you, will provoke you to join me in the campaign to ensure safe water for all. I thank you very much. Good night.